G'day. Paul here down at Curlin Beach on the 19th of October, the first day back from South Australia where we went for nine weeks to support my sister during her uh, suffering from pancreatic cancer. We had to leave her yesterday and come home. We'd booked our flights and so we flew back to Maroochydore yesterday and back home last night. But it's beautiful to be back on the beach at sunset and to share a word with you. The word today is coming out of Hebrews 13, verse 14 to 16. For this world is not our permanent home. We are looking forward to a home yet to come. And oh, how true that is. My sister doesn't have many days to live. Probably another week or two, we're not sure, unless there's an absolute miracle. But she's going to her permanent home in, in glory, God willing. And, and so are we all if we follow Jesus Christ, our Saviour. Verse 15, therefore let us offer through Jesus a continual sacrifice of praise to God, proclaiming our allegiance to his name. And don't forget to do good and to share with those in need. These are the sacrifices that please God. Hallelujah. Don't forget to do good and to share with those in need. And to give continual praise to God through Jesus Christ our, our Saviour. He is the one that came to earth and gave up his life, sacrificed his blood so that we might get reconnected to our Creator. And what a beautiful gift that was and we thank you Jesus for giving your life for us that we might have eternal life. You know those who believe in him, those who call upon his name and believe in their heart that he is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords have an eternal home with Jesus and our Heavenly Father. So. This is not our home, even though it is beautiful as the sun's going down on the ocean. It's a beautiful place. It's not our permanent home. We are heavenly beings. We are spiritual beings, heavenly beings, with our citizenship in glory. And uh, just encourage you to get into his word. Let his word get into you. Keep lifting up praises to our Father in heaven through Jesus Christ, his Son, here in this place. Thank you Father for sending us Jesus that we might have his spirit live in us. The Christ in us is the hope of glory. Oh Father God and we know the whole earth groans waiting for the sons and daughters of God to be revealed. So thank you Lord Jesus for this day for bringing Pauline and I back to Coolum Beach and for allowing us to continue to put your word out there on YouTube and to share it with the world. Get into the Word yourself. Let the Word of God get into you. And we'll see you tomorrow in another place. God bless you. Bye for now.